When you're bringing video signals like SDI or HDMI into a computer through a capture card or into video processors like a spider through its video inputs, it's important for those signals to be timed with the internal timing of that system. So the external source, HDMI or SDI, has to be retimed in the capture card to match the timing of the computer. This is where frame buffer comes in. So there's frame buffer memory in the capture card that'll store frames of video coming in. In an ultra low latency, it might only store one frame, so which is great for lowering latency, but the problem is if you drop a frame for any reason, there's no more frames in memory to backfill and you might see the signal take a hit or lose signal on screen. In a normal latency mode, you're gonna store multiple frames in this frame buffer, so if you lose a frame or two, you still have extra frames internal to the memory to backfill, so you're not gonna see any signal loss on screen. 